Hey guys, what's up? This is Zimmy and Basis. The next hentai I have for tonight is called... I'm sorry if I do not get the name right. Oju-sama Yomari Koso. I don't know if I got that right. I do apologize if I didn't. Um, so basically, if you don't remember this hentai, um, it basically revolves around a guy named Mamaru Makawa. If I don't get the character's names right, I do apologize. So he basically gets transferred to a certain school, and um, he gets two love letters, and the bad thing is the two girls that like him are actually daughters of, like, real gang lords in Japan, um, which uh, one of them is, excuse me, Sakura Sumiyoi. Sumiyoi. She's the daughter of a gang leader who is in the north part of Japan, uh, or uh, a part of the city, whatever uh, city they're in. And the other is Agea Kirosaki, who is the daughter of the Black Rose Mafia leader who rules the southern half of the city. And so he's basically in the middle of it because both girls hate each other, but, um, but both girls like um, Akawa. So... <clears throat> So in the first episode, um, you see that those two um, like the same guy, but of course, Sakura Sumiyoi is the first person to actually have sex with him, and yeah, so he falls in love with her, and then second episode, they go out, and some a few of the gang leaders go with him just for protection, and then he disappears, and... Agea Kirosaki actually gets a hold of him. I think it was like a tower or whatever, haunted house or whatever. Basically captures him, then she seduces him, then they have sex, and then he likes her. So towards the end of that episode, those two are actually together in the guy's house, you know, arguing over him, and then the dude's sister comes in. And these two are like, who the hell is she? And then they're all getting jealous. And it's like, oh, that's my sister. And then so um, Akawa and, of course, his little sister um, walk away while Kirosaki and Sumiyoi um, basically just sit there and be like, his little sister upstaging us. And then, you know, they go in and try to, like, um, win him back or something like that. And so that's pretty much how it ended. Um, of course, I feel like it should have another episode for this reason because, I mean, it was really short. Like, it was like 15 or 17 minutes, somewhere around there for two episodes. And it just ended so short because, I mean, it's like they introduced a new character. Those two are still butting heads fighting for the same guy. So it's like... A cliffhanger so if they were to make another episode what I would love to see is like um, of course I'm I hate to step in the incest territory but you know what happens if his little sister does like him and they do have sex but if they don't but she likes him as just a regular baller but those two actually you know um, kind of find a way to um, plot and get rid of her it, it's kind of weird though but, you know, I mean, they could always do the harem route or one of those two girls could fight each other, have a big gang war in the hentai and then just, you know, see who gets the guy. Or they could all just live happily ever after or he could just pick either one of them or, you know, do whatever they can. So that's just my honest opinion, but that'd be definitely something cool to see. So anyways, all right, guys, this is Emmy and Basis. I talked and oriented about... Oju-sama Yomari Kuso. And I hope you all have a good day night when you're watching this. Thank you.